Hi, it's One Invisible Song. Just I do have a new song today. The song is called Focus, and again, this is an acronym uh, for something. The F is follow, uh, O is one, C is course, U is until, and S is successful. And the words in Hebrew will be explained underneath the video. Focus, follow one course until successful. So you can quote to Hunin properly. Pay attention to what you're doing and the attention to accomplish your goal or goals. You need a road map, compass guide, or directions. That being the divine and holy Torah written by Hashem Yitbarach. So as not to veer of course and go backwards instead of forward. Of course it is likely to happen, since we all are human and imperfect. That stumble at times because of the influence of the Yetzer Hara and his undercutting slick tactics, so you don't end up what some would call Haredi or fanatic. Not that there is anything wrong with that, although some think it has negative connotations, but it shows you are a true, true, a uh, so hold your and warrior for Kaddish Baruch Hu. And do not budge even a crumb from the end that living according to the Haratzon of the Boreum uh, Olam. Focus, follow one course until successful. As the saying goes, it is easier said than done. Because we're getting pulled in so many directions. In the fast paced world of technology and temptations, and have almost no time to focus on the reality of what is really going on. And that is the sad part for me to see and observe how the human existence is going, existence is going so deep into a downward spiral, except for the hardcore that are constantly connected or glued to Hashem Yitbarach and absolutely will never budge from the truth no matter what. That doom is eminent and seems like there is absolutely no way to pull yourself up and out of this life-threatening situation. Those who stay the course, living the life that adheres to the Torah 100% without fail, uh, uh, of course, have the shield and protection of Kadosh Baruch Hu, although they may at times slip ever so slightly because of outside influences. Namely, from the evil inclination. But they know enough to keep persevering and put in the effort to help them get strong and stay strong to do the will of Avinu Shabbat Shalmayim. We cannot give in to the nonsense of this fleeting finite world because it has absolutely nothing that can benefit us in the end based on the physicality of it as the only thing that will support the eternality of our soul in the next world is our studying, learning, and practicing the mitzvah and doing chesed for others. Please, I beg one and all, and I ask Hashem to help as well. Don't give up or give in. Don't choose to do all those mitzvot that make sense to you and leave out the rest or pick and choose because say it is too difficult, inconvenient, and the like. But since the Bar Olam gave it to us all in his Torah, then he knew it is possible for all of us to do, even when we struggle. But keep up the effort regardless, day after day, and try our best. Hashem is aware that we have made an attempt, and it counts for something in the Olam Ha'emet. Thanks for listening, One Invisible Songstress.